Right now we think in triangles and squares and circles and our math tells us that that's the way things work. If there's anything that's coming down the road that could potentially obsolete some of the ways that we currently manufacture, we want to become the best at that new technology. We're out looking into every opportunity that we can to utilize additive to solve a problem. Adding this technology gives us a leg up on our competition, allows us to put another tool in our toolbox. Our customers are under continuous pressure to innovate. We're now able to make products that otherwise we would have never been able to make using any other type of technology. We're always looking for better ways to serve our customers, to help them serve their customers. What I'm seeing in my teams is this new thought process that they've developed. They are challenging the way that they would traditionally design a method for manufacturing. And once you have this flexibility to design any way you want, there's no going back. With NBG technology, which are developed by Desk of Metal, we're able to increase production rates, decrease the global cost, but in the same time, uh, we are able to increase the definition and accuracy of the parts. So Ford is a pioneer partner of Desktop Metal, and we're looking at many ways to integrate 3D printing into what we call the factory of the future. I think customers are gonna love the way that 3D printing can customize parts just for them. You could imagine tailor fitting or printing the seat to your particular uh, body shape. There are many possibilities here, and uh, we're looking forward to uh, the next iteration of their technology, which is the production system. We're extremely excited to get the production system in-house at Alpha Precision Group. We have a space available. We're excited about building it out and making it ready for the future of manufacturing with the production system. You know, MIM currently is the largest player in the metal injection molding area. The MIM tooling can be anywhere between $20,000 to $100,000. You know, a lot of times the customers, you know, either change their design and, and move away from the metal injection molding. So we want to be able to be the first in the industry who can uh, provide samples for the customer evaluation within days, not within weeks or within months. And that too at a very, very low cost, you know, probably a fraction of the cost that currently they are you know, spending. And Biotajet 3D printing is definitely capable of achieving that. That's why, you know, we fell in love with desktop metal from day one because they talk our language. You know, production systems. Companies that feel like metal 3D printing is too far in the future, if additive manufacturing adds value to them whatsoever and they're not investing in it, then they're already behind. It's touched a lot of different areas of our plant. We have utilized it now to the point where we aren't really able to go away from it anymore. We are dependent upon it. Not being a part of this conversation would be a completely missed opportunity. And so that's why we're actively working with companies like Desktop Metal so that we can drive that future as opposed to letting it happen to us. What is happening uh, here uh, is extremely important, not only for the future of manufacturing, the future of industry and the future of business, but for the, the future of our civilization uh, itself.